Etsy and Facebook sales, many moms are able to make a buck while they stay at home and take care of their kids. But as Latricia Thomas tells us in tonight's Made in Our Hometown, one local mother is using her sewing machine to help her family grow. Latricia. Adding to your family isn't always as easy as parents hope, but when one local mom discovered how much not one, but two adoptions cost, she taught herself to sew on YouTube and looked across the ocean for inspiration. Um. Brandy Santos is a mother of one with another on the way next month. Can you show them your dance? But her family isn't complete. My husband and I did struggle with fertility, and the Lord was so good to provide two very surprising miracle pregnancies. Five years ago, Santos and her husband Jordan felt called to adopt. Just like many couples, whenever you pursue adoption, you get overwhelmed once you look at all the paperwork and the financial side of things. And so the long process of of raising money began. Their goal to bring home two siblings from Africa. So on every product Santos makes, we have a heart uh, located where Ethiopia is. On tote bags, t-shirts, and jewelry, the place where two new sons or daughters will be waiting. Ethiopia is surrounded by all these nations that are war-stricken, um, filled with famine and all sorts of disease and. Uh, a lot of the ch a lot of the parents, their goal is to get their children within the borders of Ethiopia because it gives them a shot of being adopted out. Each project starts with brightly colored raw material. So what you're going to do is you're going to put it on your hoop. After a few sprays of adhesive, the first embroidery go round begins. Outlining the shape that carries the family's purpose. I didn't want to just do something random to raise money. I wanted to make sure that it was a marker of um, what God is doing in our family and where He's calling us to. Over the years, it's grown my faith in ways that I didn't think it could. A donated sewing machine and support from family and friends pushed the project forward. Our costs are going to be around $35,000. We are at about 17, uh, so we're halfway through. Helping this family pave the way for what they call their missing links. We don't have all the money in the world, but we have the home. We've got the fridge. So um, whether or not I can have children has nothing to do with being obedient. And to see all the products that help fund the Santos adoptions, we provided a link to her Etsy page on our website, newschannel9.com. Just click on this story. Okay.